Hello, welcome to this module. In this module, we will talk about most popular and user-friendly slicing software that is Cura. As we have been discussed so far that after completing your CAD model, we have to do slicing of that CAD model and this slicing will be done by Cura. So what is Cura? Cura is a slicing software for 3D printers. It takes a 3D model and slices into layers to create a file known as G code which is the code that a 3D printer understand so basically 3D printer understand only G code before we look at cura there's a little bit more to the whole print process when it comes to the 3D files there are three basic stages to preparing files for 3D printing the first is modeling this is carried out in any 3D modeling software such as Tinkercad, SketchUp, AutoCAD, SolidWorks which all are the different applications. These applications have their own file format and these enables you to open, edit, save and export those 3D printer files from the application. The second stage after the modeling is to 3D file export. Once you have created your model it then needs to be exported as either an STL, OBJ or 3MF file. These are the file formats that are recognized by Cura. They differ from the file formats that are native to the 3D modeling applications as they just hold the final geometry and not the individual primitive and editable content. Still, you can change the size of the 3D model but not the geometry. The third step is to slicing file export. The STL or OBJ file then be imported into the Cura software where it is sliced and output is G code. This G code is just a text document with a list of commands for a 3D printer to read and follow such as hot and temperature, move to the left this much, write that much it's extra. The first stage of the process requires 3D modeling but if your modeling abilities are just in their early stages then you can pop along to sites such as Thingiverse, Cults or My Mini Factory and download millions of pre-made and print ready models. These are usually in the STL format and ready to be imported directly into the Cura software. What does the Cura software do. Cura slices 3D models. It translates the 3D STL, OBJ or 3MF file into a file format that the printer can understand. Fused filament fabrication or FDM 3D printers print one layer upon another to build up the 3D object. Cura 3D takes the 3D model and works out how those layers are placed on the print bed and creates a set of instructions for the printer to follow layer on layer. Cura generates instructions for your 3D printer. They are called G-Code, a text document that ends with the file extension .gcode. Open the file and you will actually be able to read through quite a bit of the code and understand what it's telling the printer to do. Here is a small snapshot how these G-Codes look like. As you become more adept at 3D printing, you can go into these code and adjust fan speeds, layer heights and hot end temperatures at different points. This can be handy when you need to troubleshoot some 3D print problems. The G code can then be saved to an SD card or sent to the printer over wireless or cable depending on the printer directly from Cura. In the next video, we will talk about how you can download Cura free and how to install it. Thank you. If you want to learn complete 3D printing and make a career in this field, you can click to the link given in description box and start your journey now. In this course, you will learn 3D printing also known as additive manufacturing from start to finish. This course includes design of 3D models, slicing of 3D model, 3D scanning, types of 3D printers, STL file formats, post-processing, 3D printing materials and many more along with assignments and quizzes. At the end of the course, you will get a certificate which will help you for your job interviews. The prices of course is so minimal that everyone can afford. 
सो सी यू इन साइड दी कोर्स थैंक यू